Welcome to Joe Proud, Pinoy Vlad. Philippine Air Force to get Israeli fighter air defense system by end of this year. The Philippine Air Force on Tuesday announced that the first two of three spider air defense missile systems will be delivered by the last quarter of this year. The spider Philippines air defense system is very much on time. Delivery will be earlier than scheduled January 2023 and it will be in the country by end of November to the first week of December. The project is for three batteries. The first delivery will be two batteries. Air Force spokesperson Colonel Maynard Mariano said in a message to the Philippine News Agency Tuesday. Battery refers to the grouping of missile launchers. A normal battery consists of three or more missile launchers. Spider is short for surface-to-air Python and thereby mobile air defense system that was developed by the Israeli defense technology firm Rafael Advanced Defense Systems with assistance from Israel Aerospace Industries. Mariano added that the last Spider battery will be delivered along with a missile maintenance facility which will be built in the Philippines, giving military personnel the capability to maintain the weapon system. We have upgraded the program. The last battery will be delivered with a missile maintenance facility to be built in the country at no expense to the government. There will be a technology transfer that goes with this and it will make us capable of maintaining missile systems and will greatly help in the sustainment of the program, Mariano said. Earlier, the PAF said it can now train on various surface air missile engagement techniques after it formally accepted its first missile simulator, the Spider Philippines Air Defense Systems Simulator Training Center last April 26. The facility is located at the Basa Air Base in Florida Blanca, Pampanga. This pad simulator training center is the AFP's Armed Forces of the Philippines first missile training center, which will serve as a training ground for future missile operators to prepare them to real world challenges, as well as to increase personal knowledge, skills, and develop the right attitude for air and missile defense, he said. The SPAD Simulator Training Center is part of the Ground-Based Air Defense System, or GBAD's acquisition project of the PAC, which seeks to enhance the military's defense capabilities. The Simulator Training Center aims to develop three different capabilities, detection through radar, command and control, and missile firing. It is also custom-made for the men and women of the PAC to utilize in their training on advanced air defense techniques. The notice of award for the GGABS acquisition project was released in 2019. Source from the Philippine News Agency, Mabuhay ang Pilipinas. Thank you and God bless.